Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a Patreon request and it's from Robert. And this is like bridge over troubled waters with Sissel, Kyrkeby and Russell Watson. Kyrkeby? Is that a Danish name? I feel like I should know that. Anyway, um, thank you so much for this request and thank you so much for supporting me on the Patreon. If you also want to recommend songs and join the family, you can click in the link in the description. There's not much else to say other than, obviously I don't know the song, but um, I'm pretty excited to see what it is. Um, and um, yeah, I just like a good mixture, if you haven't noticed on this channel, of music that I love and know, that I'm diving deeper into, and also just, you know, broadening my knowledge, broadening my knowledge about fantastic music in the world. And there's a lot of copyright blocks and stuff going on, and I just want to let you know that some artists, like Pentatonix, for example, all of their music is basically blocked, like permanently, even though I dispute a claim. So that's why I basically don't react to them. Um, because my way of reacting is just that I watch the whole thing and just take it in and then I talk after the song Because for me, it's really like Ruining the first experience if I have to stop and then comment because you know, I'm thinking about it this way A song is kind of designed to be listened to from the beginning to the end. So Anyway, let's get started one. Here we go when you
Okay, that was sweet. Um, so I didn't know any of these singers, um, but wow, such you know, sophistication and such clarity and and control. But like, it was still like warm and laid back and kind. It was just super soothing to watch these two people sing. And just the clarity, you know, they were great singers, both of them. And I loved her, like, really sweet, bright, light voice. Um, it was just beautiful, especially in the beginning when she started so softly and then, you know, went up um, and, and added more, like, power. And then his voice was just very, like, creamy and... I don't know if this, you know, is actually uh, that kind of song, but to me it was almost like um, yeah, it was just like it was a very sweet and beautiful duet, and it reminded me almost like of a Disney song where you know the two main characters falling in love or creating a fin meaningful friendship they sing this beautiful duet. That was kind of the vibe I got from it, also because the orchestra made it so like big and fairy tale-ish. It was just so pretty. Um, and and his like creamy, warm, extremely soothing voice. It was incredible even like, especially also I noticed when he was belting, it was just so embracing and soothing. And of course he like removed, you know, created more distance from his mouth to his microphone so that it wouldn't be too loud. Um, but still it was just like, there was just no edginess to it. It was just so warm and soft. And because both of them kind of had that quality, it was just melting beautifully together. Um, so they were super nice. And also just, you know, they just both radiated this calm elegance and just maturity. And it was just, I felt so like almost safe watching this, um, this was really, really nice. Um, and yeah, uh, it was definitely a great in introduction. I don't know what, it, since I don't know the artist, I don't know what they usually do, if this is their typical genre or like if they have done music before together, of this is, was like a one-time event, but neither, case, neither the case, it was just a very nice match. Like the person who have kind of put this up, um, if it was them or not, Somebody just saw that, okay, this is actually a really good match. And also I just love the part when they kind of, you know, at the end were singing together. Um, 
it was just beautiful to listen to the harmonies and mm, it was just delicious. And again, you could see, which is always a pleasure for me, that you can just see how much people, you know, when they sing, they just embrace it. And sometimes I think that that is maybe one of the main reasons for why people want to sing. Because one, it's a nice way to express yourself. And two, you can kind of, you know, the, the watching somebody actually being in the center of attention, putting themselves out there and having a great experience, but also just watching them being so, you know, engulfed in it and just, you know, f so enjoying it. I think that's very persuasive for so many people, which is why singing is so popular because you just watch people sing and you're like, Mwah! I want to be on that stage and just, you know, shine and just be confident and just love what I do and maybe just disappear into the music, be a part of the music and just share that moment with so many people. It is a really magical moment and this performance just reminded, reminded me of that. So thank you so much Robert for recommending me this, it was awesome, it was stunning and I would like to hear what you out there have to say to this. Was this also your first time watching this duet and what do you think about it? And maybe if you know anything about the two artists, you can share it in the comments. I would love to like hear what you have to say. Of course, I could just Google, but why should I do that when it's much more fun to have interactions with you? And also I find that sometimes you have some insider knowledge um, that can be in sometimes very difficult to, to find online or at least know what, which thing is actually really the fact. So let's have a lovely chat in the comment section. I can't wait to hear from you. And thank you so much for watching. I hope I will see you very soon. And I love you. Bye.